There's one supplement I really, really wish every woman trying to conceive would actually take. And I do not say this lightly because I never make blanket statements like this. No other supplement I would say you just really got to take. But in this case, the research is overwhelming. Clinical outcomes are undeniable. And I've seen transform my client cycles as well. And their sleep and mood and cervical mucus, even implantation success. And that supplement is bum, 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 magnesium. Now, not all magnesium is created equal, and I need to warn you here, most of you are probably taking magnesium oxide. And just chuck that out into the bin, into the garbage, because this is exactly where it belongs to. It's cheap, the least absorbable form on the market. It barely gets into your cells. It goes pretty much straight through your digestive system and does next to nothing. So if you've been taking magnesium and not feeling a difference, this is exactly why. You need a form that actually gets into your cells, supports progesterone production and helps your body clear excess estrogen, then calms your nervous system, improves insulin sensitivity and supports your mitochondria. These are the little energy factories in your eggs and in your cells that determine whether or not fertilization and implantation can even happen. Inside my fertility circle, this is the place where I teach women how to get to hormonal balance and to a better place in their fertility to create a baby. In there, I suggest specific forms and brands of magnesium because when you take the right one, you can literally feel your body exhale. Then stress drops, PMS symptoms reduce, sleep can improve, bowel movement can normalize and your reproductive system gets the message. It's safe to ovulate safe to produce progesterone and safe to conceive. And now you don't have to get into the fertility circle just to get that information. I give you that here. Um, but if you are trying to get pregnant and not taking magnesium yet, then this is really your sign. Go and get magnesium. And the best all-rounder is magnesium glycinate. If you're trying to conceive, that's your best thing. If you're really constipated, you could try magnesium citrate. And But if you're not constipated, don't do that. Magnesium malate is something else, which is actually quite nice, but the best around is glycinate. If you haven't got magnesium already in your cupboard, it might be one thing you want to consider. I take it on and off all the time because this little supplement can make a massive difference in your fertility journey.